Hey YouTube, this is Robin Lance one here, and I'm here to do the review for the Doctor Who series finale. Um, this, this review will cover 10, 11, and 12 of the series finale of series 9. So let's get started. Um, basically what happens at the end, um, during this episode is, um, or during the early parts of this, um, three-parter, is the Doctor and Clara arrive on the, on Earth, and it sort of goes in this Harry Potter-esque, um, esque, uh, style, and basically it sees, um, the Doctor and Clary and Clary, Clara, um, come into contact with um, a person who came in episode in in series eight last year. I can't remember his name, but basically, um, he has this tattoo that is counting down towards. His, towards his own death, and the Doctor and Clara basically have to try and save him. And we finally get a tie-in to um, all that Clara death um, stuff that's been going on within the last few episodes of this series. And we get... An Clara's recklessness basically results in her own death. And that possibly had to be the most fascinating part of the entire um, episode of episode 10. Um, the fact that Clara's own recklessness and her belief that the Doctor would cure everything was really, really interesting, and I really, really liked it. Um, I thought that the interactions between Clara and the Doctor were absolutely great. Um, the Doctor's interaction with me was really, really good. Um, and it was just an all-round great episode, and I loved the concept of basically an alien Diagon Alley. Um, episode 10 really felt like a Harry Potter story, and it just worked really, really well. Episode 11, on the other hand, it was interesting, episode 11, but it kind of left a lot to be desired. Um, basically, in what happens in episode 11 is the Doctor is basically in his own prison. Um, the Doctor has to basically reveal secrets about his past and about certain thoughts. And basically they use Clara's death um, as basically like a mind palace um, of sorts. Um, and it basically sees the Doctor and Clara sort of still having that interaction, but not at the same time. And, I don't know, this episode didn't carry quite the same weight as episode 10 did. Um, it was basically a lot of walking around, um and not really doing very much for an entire episode. And then, oh wait, here comes Gallifrey. And I'm like, really? This episode is how you're bringing back Gallifrey. Like, really? Like, I did feel like we were waiting around for a very, like, for basically 45 minutes for Gallifrey. And whilst I was really, really excited about seeing Gallifrey, 
Um, I, I did. I just didn't like how they set um that up and how they introduced Gallifrey. Um, I just felt it could have been done better. I get what I get. What was trying to what was what they what they were trying to do. They were basically trying to sort of explore the Doctor's mindset. Um, and basically he's wasted all these years. It, it just wasn't a very interesting episode to me. However, episode 12, on the other hand, was absolutely fantastic. It does slightly ruin episode 10, but seeing Gallifrey again was absolutely fantastic. Um, I thought the way the Doctor interacted with Clara was, again, really fascinating. And sort of getting to know who the hybrid was. I still don't get who the hybrid is or what it's supposed to be. From what I could gather, the hybrid is basically what could what would have been the culmination between the Doctor and Clara. Um, and that basically the Doctor and Clara are basically so in sync, um, and that Clara is the chaos between the Doctor's order. And basically when the two are together, they push the boundaries of the Doctor's own ethics. And that leads to the Doctor becoming quite dangerous. Um, and that's all I can really say about that. Because I didn't really get what the hybrid was. I might get it again in another... In another watch, but... All in all, um, these three episodes were pretty darn good. Um, the reason why episode 12 slightly ruins episode 9 is because they brought back Clara. I felt like Clara's death was perfect. I didn't like how they basically took away, um, they took that death away from Clara and the Doctor, and ended up resulting in a bit of a, a bit of a, what's the word, just they, they lessened the moment, um, and now we have Clara running around, um, around the time stream. So, and we do and we don't know what happened to the universe, um, to Gallifrey. So I'm hoping what's going to happen is they actually bring back Gallifrey again, but make it into a proper event. Because I felt like the return of Gallifrey should have been an, an event, like how... It, the Matt Smith era made it kind of like an event. All in all, this was a pretty good, um, this was a pretty good, decent, um, three-parter episode. Um, I will be reviewing the Christmas special, so stay tuned for that. And I also have, um, a bunch of the other reviews that I've still yet to do, um, coming as well. So stay tuned for that also. Bye.